dear students in this video i'm going to tell you about the constitution of india as we all know we are living in a democratic country and in this democratic country people are free to choose their government but do you think they are free to do whatever they like there are certain basic rules that they have to follow and government have to follow also all such rules together are called constitution so what is constitution the constitution of a country is a set of written rules that are accepted by all people living together in a country so these for making this constitution they first they have just made an assembly to make a constitution so what is a that assembly was known as constituent assembly so what is a constituent assembly a constituent assembly or a constitutional assembly is a body or assembly of popularly elected representatives which is assembled for the purpose of drafting or adopting a constitution or similar documents in there were some important members in the constituent assembly so many were there but we have some names like jawaharlal nehru rajendra prasad sardar patel mulana abdul kalam azad were important leaders who guided the discussion in assembly sarojini naidu and vijay lakshmi pandit were important women members in the constituent assembly and how they have made the constituent assembly what is the composition the total membership of the constituent assembly was 389 of which 292 292 members were representative of provinces and 93 represented the princely states now we will read about the work how they worked for the for making constitution the constituent assembly at work on 9th december 1946 the constituent assembly sat for the first time for taking the decision of constitution in the span of 2 years and 11 months it completed its task of framing the indian constitution in the span of 2 years in the span of means they took the time of 2 years and 11 months for completing the task which task that means framing the constitution on 26 november the constituent assembly adopted the constitution students there is a difference on 26th november it was adopted constitution was adopted in india and it came in force on 26th january 1950 i hope this is clear till here in my next video I, we will discuss about the rest part like drafting committee and preamble thank you very much